how to grow green, also known as African spinach. The plant name is Amaranthus hybridus, also known as smooth pigweed, green amaranth, Efo tete calabo, calalu, um, Efo bayan, and Efo shoko. Um, welcome to Seven Savings Garden, where we talk about gardening, ways to save money, and other special events. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get notified of all upcoming videos. Hello everybody. So today we're going to be talking about growing green. Green is a very popular um, spinach-like vegetable uh, that's grown in Africa and other uh, areas of the world. Um, it has different names. I'm sure if I'm saying this, some of you might say what's green. So let me show you why I tell you more about it. So uh, this is it. So this is green right here. Um, uh, it's it's like I said, it's a popular um, ve vegetable. Um, it's also called Efortete. Uh, the plant biological or the plant name for it is Amaranthus hybridus, and uh, some sometimes it's also called smooth pig pigweed green amaranth or alofe or efe or bayan or efe efo. Shoka. So those are these are uh, some of the names that has been called. Um, as you see here, I'm growing a lot of them over here, and and they are very easy to grow and and they re grow very fast, especially if you let them grow to maturity. They they, they can, you can easily get them like these, and they will grow and grow and grow, and you can get a lot of vegetable from them um like that so uh, they're easy to, to grow all you need to do is get their seeds and then you sprinkle your seeds in your garden and it gets germinates and it starts going and you can definitely grow quite a lot of them and, and they can easily spread and occupy your whole garden if you're not careful uh, because once they mature like these uh, these are all the, these are gonna produce seeds right there and once the seeds spread on the ground, next year they're gonna come up and you're gonna get them here after year, year after year. And, and they produce a lot of seeds and they spread very, very fast. So one of the things that you're gonna find out um, if you grow green is that sometimes they are yellow like this. Um, this, they're very um, nitrogen consuming, high nitrogen consuming. Uh, vegetables they need a lot of nitrogen so if you see them uh, yellowing like this it means either there are too many in one area and they all of them are fighting for that limited resources or there's not enough nitrogen in the ground or nutrients in the ground for them to to be able to um, absorb and and uh, and do well they might still continue to grow but the, the color is gonna be it's not gonna be green it's gonna be yellow like this um, See, like this one right here this is pure yellow it's still you can still harvest it you can still eat it um, but it just tells you that um, it needs a little bit more nutrients or they maybe there are too many different uh, uh, vegetables fighting for the resources in that small area so you can add more compost to the area or you can put some organic fertilizers um, you can put more organic fertilizers, compost, manure, or anything that's gonna provide it a little bit more nutrients and it's gonna do uh, much better if you do that. If you like the video, please smash the like button. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to share. So I'll put the list of uh, the fertilizers uh, that you can use. Uh, some of the organic fertilizers that's gonna help boost uh, boost the uh, production and boost the uh, the color and bring it back to neutral level. I'll put some of the uh, top fertilizers that you can use for, for it in the link uh, in the description below. So let me show you an example. This is how it's supposed to look. As you can see, it's green and doing well with, with the green leaves. So this one has is getting enough nutrients and is doing well. Uh, and also needs area where there's a good sunlight and like i said there are plants that can easily grow anywhere and you can easily grow them anywhere in your 
a garden or you can also grow them in containers let me know uh, in the comments below if you know about green if you grow green if you've seen it somewhere or you've grown it yourself let me know in the comments below if you know, have any other ideas on what you do and uh, various ways that you've seen it either grown or used um so most often uh we use it as a vegetable we make a, ve a vegetable uh, dish and we eat it like that I am I'm, i know i've seen people mix it with other vegetables but uh, it is a uh, vegetable that you can use and you can have a vegetable dish by itself and so a lot of people grow it for different reasons so just let me know in the comments below if you have other ways or other uses of of this um, particular vegetable so as you see all these that I'm, I'm showing you here I did not plant them this year I planted these um i think four or five years ago and every time the uh every time the seeds drop the next year we get we get more so every year we get a lot of it and we just have to take out some of them and just keep the rest but it comes out by itself once you plant it in any area make sure that um if you don't harvest it before the seeds come out like this if you don't harvest it before the seeds come out you're gonna get you're gonna get more producing uh, more seeds next year because it's gonna spread all over your garden and it's gonna take over your garden so just be careful if you're gonna plant it uh, and you don't mind having it uh, take over a portion of your garden then that's fine but if you uh, really want to um, pre prevent it from taking over your garden just specify a little area where you want it to grow and once you start producing uh, seeds like this you want to cut it off or you want to harvest it so that it doesn't produce seeds and spread all over the garden but uh, any apart from that everything is good um it's a great easy vegetable to grow and you're able to get vegetable throughout the season and you can get as much vegetable as you want because it just keeps producing once you harvest it more and more comes out so we harvested this over here and more heads come out you can harvest it here harvest it here like this and then more is gonna come out you can see um little ones coming out right here so once you harvest these uh new ones new ones are gonna come out and you're gonna keep harvesting it like that uh throughout the growing season okay i think that is it for today i hope you like the video if you like the video please give it a thumbs up